Next up, we have Grayson number five. Now, I haven't read Grayson since the first one, and I was really excited about it, just lost track of it. So I wanted to jump back on as soon as I can. And I'm not exactly sure what's going on. We started in a helicopter um, that's been hit with an EMP by Argus, and it's dropping down in the middle of the desert. At the same time, a random woman is giving birth. Dick Grayson's trying to help, um, and Midnighter is there. I'm, again, I'm not exactly sure what's going on. Plane crashes. Um, the mother dies, baby's saved. They have to trek across the desert for safety. Midnighter just wants to basically be done with it. Um, you hand him the baby, he'll take care of everything, which is clearly not a good idea. So they start trekking across the desert. Um, helicopter pilot forgot her name, but she was wounded in the process and she's severely hurt. Eventually she gives way and she's left behind. Midnighter the whole time is anti antagonizing Grayson about uh, give me the baby, I'll take care of it, I'll do this, I'll do that. Basically, it's going to mean the end of the baby, the baby's going to die. And we realize that the baby is of the utmost, utmost importance, and Grayson does everything he can to protect the baby. And this is where the, the story is a little slow, because Grayson doesn't say much. You have Midnighter just antagonizing him the most time. We do get a little retribution, but it's mainly Grayson just carrying the baby across the desert. And that gets a little boring, a little old especially when we come to the ending, which I honestly have no idea what it means. I need to go back and check out four uh, and three, two, one, and find out what I'm missing on this. I'm curious though, because it makes a report of what happened not real. Like, are we imagining, are we dreaming or something going on? I, I, that's why I'm not exactly sure what the ending means. I'm definitely gonna read six to find out what's going on. I recommend you check it out. I'm a big fan of this. I like Grayson on his own, I thought, the lead up to this where he beat uh, him and Batman went head to head. Basically, it would never be to the end because neither would kill each other, but it went that close. Basically, Bruce Wayne testing uh, Batman, or I'm sorry, Robin, Dick Grayson, Nightwing, to see if he could make it on his own for real. So I'm, I'm glad to see Grayson is doing exactly that. Check it out. Three and a half out of five nerd skulls. Mm -hmm.